uh, liver blood deficiency. Uh, in this case, we we still on the, the pathologies of uh, deficiency. Here, we want basically to use points um, on the drain, points that affect the drain, which are, um, I mentioned before or not? No, I didn't mention it before. So to work on drain, we have, let's do the green. So we have, uh, I'm sorry. changing the color. So, Duane, liver 1, pericard 9, REN 18. If it's not possible to use these strong points or painful points, we can go directly to the source point, liver 3, pericard 7. Now we want to strengthen the wood, so we can use the water and the water, the wood and the water, the water on the wood, and the wood on the wood. Okay? You with me? So, uh, these points will basically influence or strength the, 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 the liver, first of all, because the liver is too weak to, uh, or to move or to circulate the chi and the blood. So, the liver needs the support from the mother element or father element, uh, water or kidney in this case. And um, another way to, uh, to boost the, 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 the blood will be from the chong. Okay, so spleen four with pericardium six, uh, pericardium six, and uh, still it's on the same uh, level of the juayin, so it goes uh, perfectly. And the liver constitutional influence will be with uh, triple omer two, liver one, liver three, pericardium eight. Okay, so some of these are working uh, together. Um, so in all conditions, basically, later on we can see also stagnation. So the basis is still the same basis. The structure is the same because we want to work on Juayin. We want to... Now, in this case, we can add also some points that um, if we find that the spleen, for example, is too weak, so obviously we can work also on the tie-in, okay? Tie-in, uh, spleen, lung, okay? But mostly spleen, is the one that uh, can create some some chi. Okay, but again, if it's just the liver that is influenced and weak, happens again <laughs> with my pen. So if it's just the liver, uh, I will just go um, to work on the liver. If I see that the spleen is weak also, and we can see some signs on the, on the tongue, too. It means that if we see, for example, um, if we see some weakness here, like um, uh, sinking or the other way of swelling, or if we can see some uh, tooth marks. Okay, sorry for the now working with the mouse. It's more difficult to <laughs> draw with that. Okay, so if we see other signs of spleen deficiency, or if we um, talk with the patient about the diet and we see that the diet is really poor and the, the, that's what creates the, the deficiency of the blood, so of course we can use that too. Uh, but again, with Chong Mai, we have the connection to the Juayin and the Taiin, or specifically the spleen. Okay, so... The herbal formula, the best one will be buds and tongue, okay, all the herbs that, um, here I think it's with the modification even, yeah, with the two herbs uh, modification. It's possible to do some modifications or just, you know, sometimes the companies um, 
who, who sell the, the, the herbs, the patent herbs, they, they could use uh, some modification in adding one or two or three herbs. It's, uh, it's quite good. They know what they do, apparently, and um, we can use that. So we don't have to, be, to, to get stuck just on the eight herbs of the formula. Okay, so it's, uh, it's okay to use other, um, some other uh, modifications too.